here. And I'm doing this episode of Pixelmon Solo today because of reasons. We still haven't worked out all the kinks with Matt's uh, voice in the recordings. So I'm going to do this one solo today. He doesn't even know about it. So, But I found this. And this is an Ultra Ball Pohe loot. And let me close my door for a second. Okay, now that we got that done. This is an Ultra Ball Poke loot. And it just gave me TM103 Double Edge. Which I now have two of. Because I already got one from a boss fight. Um, so that's that. Uh, also guys, uh, I guess because of the whole problems with Matt's voice and the fact that it's really hard for him to have to uh, make new recordings, like just do the voiceover kind of, uh, we're not probably going to have, I'm probably not going to upload his videos or like um, the videos that he was in. So I'm going to show you guys what we did while you guys were gone. So. While you guys were gone, uh, I'm just going to go over everything that we've done, I guess. This, that's what this episode is going to be, an update kind of video. Um, we built a house next to the Pokedex, or next to the Poke Center. We found a bunch of diamonds. We found uh, a bunch of stones, and he got he made a fire stone, is what he ended up doing. Uh, we both caught Eevees, and he made his Eevee into a Flareon. I thought that was, you know, that was pretty cool. Um, look, we got... 10 diamonds right there, a bunch of lapis, yiga, a bunch of redstone, stuff like that. Um, we got a bunch of apricorns, apricowns. We built this little underground layer where we built our fossil machine finally. Did you guys see that? I don't know. If you guys didn't see that, then I'm sorry. But yeah, we built a fossil machine and fossil cleaner. Uh, it's been, we've been recording. Believe it or not, we got the Eevee, Arkin, Lapis, and the Larvitar, which I'm probably going to end up giving to Matt. Um, but the Arkin was the fossil that we found, and I'm pretty sure you guys saw epi that episode. Yeah, I'm positive you guys saw that episode. Um, if you didn't, then I'm sorry. I'll upload that part where I found it uh, right now. Okay. So, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm sure you guys got it. So ignore that little part right there. Uh, we got a healing center down here with all those diamonds. We made some diamond axes and pickaxes. We got a couple of anvils. Got all that done. And Matt and I went exploring, and we found a bunch of stuff. Uh, these trust things, these are where uh, we found all those diamonds and stuff. Uh, the savannah. I'm actually going to teleport there and show you guys because I built a house. I built my very own house in the savannah biome. You can probably see it up there on the mini-map. It's right up here. Uh, I caught a nine tails. That's a Blaziken. Level 46 Blaziken. No, thank you. Uh, we got a nine tails and an Alakazam thanks to Matt. I'm, yeah, you guys had one episode with Matt's voiceover. Yeah, you guys had one episode with Matt's voiceover and that was the episode where we got Alakazam. Um, yeah, uh, we got nine tails, uh, in, in the first episode that we recorded where we couldn't use his voice. Uh, we got nine tails. I built this. I'm, I'm proud of myself for that. Uh, and I, it took me four hours to find this biome. Four hours. It took me an hour to find this one from the house. I know I'm Steve right now and I don't know why. I think my game's glitching out a bit, but it took me a while to find this one. And Matt got a gold at. I know he got that. Uh, I don't think he caught anything else. He also evolved his Piplup into Primplup, which I think you guys saw. Um. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna get a Glaceon. Aw, oh, freaking. A Piplup! Oh, baby. Oh, baby! It just randomly attacked me. I didn't even know what it was. Oh my god, Eevee. Too OP. I know it says that I have that up there, but that's just because I traded with Matt to get uh, my Alakazam. I don't care if you use Pound on me. I'm just going to freaking use all my Pokeballs and capture you, Piplup. Oh, come on, Eevee. Come on, Piplup. Don't make me kill you. 
I don't like how they haven't updated any of the evolution models or EV. They haven't updated those models yet. But they've uploaded like ev upgraded everything else. But whatever though. We are gonna catch capture this starter. I freaking need this in my life. Oh yeah, that's the uh, Articuno shrine that we found that we had in another episode that you guys didn't get to see. I'm so sorry about that. We did record them. I'll like post it on my Twitter the actual videos because I don't want to post them up here because there's nothing really to show, you know. Go great ball. Capture that tiny little pip up. Oh, it's only level six. It's level six. Yes! We got a pip up! Ooh! We got a pip up. So I'll go show you that Articuno shrine. Since I sh I I gotta fix that. I gotta fix my software. It please don't hate. Um but we did find the shrine. It's the Articuno shrine. We found all the shrines in one episode. And I was like freaking out because I was I was gonna call it the shrine episode, but whatever. This is the Articuno shrine. It comes with all, everything you need to make the except for the orb to make the orb of frozen souls. Which I have not done yet because I want to wait. We also find the Moltres and the Zapdos Shrine. We found those too. But I can't remember exactly where all the shrines are. I, know I'm, I didn't make a waypoint here because I don't know why I was being stupid. Um, Frozen Shrine. No, not the song. Or not the movie. Frozen. Um, but what was I doing? Oh yeah, we were going to evolve my... Eevee into hey look at that it's an Empoleon what level are you Empoleon don't fight me no 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 I don't want to fight you I mean I can probably beat you but I don't want to fight you don't kill my Eevee in one shot crap now I can't do what I wanted to do leaf tornado it did like nothing Mega Drain! Okay, I'm probably screwed here. Nine Tails! Flamethrower! Okay, so no Zaku Jet. That's. That's awesome. Confusion! Confusion! Ah! <laughs> Confusion! <laughs> oh crap. Ghost Turbine! Leaf Tornado! Now Leaf Blade! Two raw fish, two snowballs, and iron ingot, and ice. Level 34. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We bad. Oh, yeah. Uh-huh. Okay, well. Can I actually break this? I guess that's a no. Okay, so that's cool. We just totally beat a level 40. Oh my gosh, that Piplup has one health. I just noticed that. Wow, if we had killed it. Jesus. Okay. Well, I guess I'll go show you guys the other shrines. Actually, I first want to show you guys the Mesa Arena. Because me and Matt worked really hard on this for like a whole episode. Uh, you can't really see it all from down here. But we're in a Mesa biome pretty close to home. And there's the Moltres Shrine right up there. And if I can get up to it. I think we might have terraformed too well. Uh, let's try to get up here. Okay, I'm not fighting you. You're way too high level. Wait, there's healing benches right there. Yeah, guys, we found so, so, so many diamonds. I think we ended up having like 18 or something. 18 each, mind you. We had so many. It was ridiculous. But, and since Piplup was Matt's starter, I'm not 100% sure if I should keep it on my party as a permanent member or not. I'll talk to him about it. But I'm sure he wouldn't mind. I mean, that's, it's not like it's anything bad or anything. And hey, it's a good Pokemon. He's got a Flareon now. So, I got a little trump card. Because he doesn't think I have any water types. But, yeah. That up there is the Moltres Shrine. Moltres. 
And there's a little bitty baby salamance. That's what salamance. That's what evolves into salamance. Bagon. Yeah. Bagon. Okay. So. Yeah, I guess. I could probably take a couple obsidian. Just in case we ever make want to make a uh, cloning machine to make, get Mew. Yeah, I think that's all we need. Just the one. Um, yeah, we found this while we were building the arena, and we were and like I saw it on my I saw a little light on my mini map at night, and I was just like, Matt, what do you um did you build something up there? He was like, What are you talking about? I was like, Zoom out on your mini map. And he was like, okay. And I was like, dude, let's go check it out. And we found this. And I don't want to disturb it to see if there is any um, fire stones. I guess we, no, there's not. Uh, I didn't want to disturb it to see if there was any. Because just in case, you know. But um, I'll just set that there. Boom. Stay away from me. Um, I guess this one doesn't come with all the fire stone star shard, pff, shards. But that's no problem. We have plenty. Like, seriously, it's ridiculous how many Firestone shards we have. Um, why is everything fighting me? I'm just gonna destroy you. Ooh, use Ember. It's barely effective. I mean, it's super effective, but it's barely effective against my awesome Sudang. Um, yeah. If you look over there on the mini-map now, you can see the whole, um, Poke Arena. Mesa Poke Arena. That's a boss! That's a boss Baldor! Dude, yeah. Go Piplup. I'm gonna give you some levels, man. Level 54. And I guess that makes sense. It just one-shot me? Alakazam Confusion! Don't, oh god, no. Piplup! Pound! Nine tails! Use Confuse Ray! Okay, now we may have a chance. Flame Charge! Just keep boosting your defense. Confuse Ray! Okay, now, just keep boosting your defense. Wait, it says it's hurting itself in, in confusion, but it's not really hurting itself. Oh my god, Eevee! Quick attack! Quick attack! Quick attack! Five more minutes of this, and maybe he'll die. Dude, if Eevee wins this. No. No. There's no way Eevee's gonna win this. This is just going to be me clicking over and over again until my level 13 EV kicks this level 54 Baldor's ass. <laughs> what the heck? Oh, it's evading now. Come on, EV, Get one shot already. This is not happening. Dude, if this happens, EV is a champion. Eevee will be a champion at life. Come on, Eevee. Hit it already, Eevee. Something hit something. Tackle. Quick attack. It's out. I'm out of quick attack. Oh my gosh! This is my last Pokemon too. Dude, okay, Eevee is a champion already. This is freaking ridiculous. And I don't think anything else is gonna happen, so... Oh, I hit it. I'm hitting it. Dude, Eevee just put a level 54 boss in the red. Eevee is the champion at life. 
A critical hit! Eevee, you boss! No. Who won? Wait, did it win? Where is that? Where? Where? I at least want the boss drops. Dude, what the heck just happened? Is Eevee that much of a pro champion at life? That was flippin' insane. Eevee lasted a good three minutes against the level 54 boss, and it still had an attack. That's the only reason it died there at the end is because it used an attack. That was insane. I'm gonna have to go back over the footage and see what move it used. Holy crap, Eevee. I am so proud of you. Oh, freaking goal it. Leaf Blade! Yeah! I'm a boss! Okay, so I guess I'll go show you guys the Zapdos Shrine. It's hard to see the shrines unless it's nighttime because they really light up. But over there near my house is where the Zapdos Shrine is. Over there where my new house is in the Mesa biome. Dude, Eevee is a boss. It was going head to head with a freaking level 54. 54. Is that, that is unheard of. And it still had attacks. It was using like all those special moves and stuff, but it still had attack. It still had an attack. That is flibbing redonk. I don't think I've ever done that before. That's pretty amazing. Comment down below if that's ever happened to you before. Because I would like to know that. Rufflet, out of my way. I'll use my Alakazam. Confusion. 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 One shot. Okay, that's great. Go, Piplop. Pound. Pound. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't think Piplop would last very long. Confuse Ray. Flame charge! Oh, baby. Okay. This is just me trying to find the friggin' entrance to this place. Did I, did I pass it? What is happening? Okay, here's the entrance. Yeah, I did pass it. So, B, and then fire shrine. Okay, and now we go... To Waypoint Savannah, teleport. Let's go heal up our Pixelmon because two of them are dead. Okay. And now it's in the opposite direction of my home. Let me look at the mini map real quick. Matt said he found it pretty easily. From there it is. I can see it on the mini map now. Yeah, it's in the northwest region. We are also uh, in... There it is. This is the biggest one, like, by far. Uh, we're also in peaceful mode. That's why we don't starve anymore. Because a lot of people were like, Yuki, just go in peaceful, in peaceful so that you don't have to worry about getting food and stuff. And for now, until we actually do get a stable farm going, that's what we're going to do. So, this is the Static Shrine. So, I'm going to put a little waypoint here first so I don't forget. Static Shrine. Okay. And now let's... This is not the entrance. That is a troll entrance, Matt. You son of a butt. Okay, it's right here. This is the entrance with all the... 
stuff. Uh, okay. Yeah, right here. See? Pretty nice. Okay, so once we get all the orbs we can and three master balls, we will be able to catch all those legend Really? Really? Why is everything battling me? Every freaking thing that is able to battle me is battling me. Hey, look, pumpkins. I do enjoy pumpkins. Yeah, so I'm going to get rid of dandelions. Doop. Okay. So I'm going to go back home. So slash kill. And I'd say that this was a pretty successful little update video. Uh, this is all Matt's stuff. He's got a diamond hammer too. He's got some cooked apricorns. He's got the last two fire shards we have. I guess he made another fire stone. Um, I'll put that iron in there with that. Um, he's got some ice as well, so I'll put that in there. He's got an iron pick. He's got some gold iron or some redstone. He's got a lot of stuff too. Um, but I think that's a pretty good update video. Let's try and go find a yellow apricorn so that we can start making some pokeballs because that's the one kind of apricorn we don't have yet. Because I want to make some ultra balls. Another Eevee? You know what? You know what? I'm gonna let Piplup take care of you since you're so close to the same level. Pound! Keep on pounding it. Eevee's avoiding attacks now. That's great. Come on. Do you remember in the anime when Sand Attack actually did some damage? Good times. Good times. Oh my god, it's about to two-shot me. It two-shot me. Eevee! Eevee, Eevee, Eevee! Tackle! I don't even care that I just killed an Eevee. Don't even care. Don't don't worry about that little thing up on the screen. Don't don't worry about that. Okay. So see the fire shrine isn't that far away from the house. We didn't have to go far for that. Is that Torterra? Why are all these freaking starters coming up and attacking me? You know what? I'm gonna capture you. Leaf Blade. I wanna capture this. I'm gonna capture this. You you watch me capture this. Okay, never mind. And I'm gonna try to capture this. That way, I will have a bunch of starters. Surveying. 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 See, because Mega Drain actually does do some damage, and it also replenishes some health. Even though he's the grass type, but he's also a ground type. So go, Great Ball. Please work. Nope. I was really actually kind of hoping that that would work. Let's see if my boss, Eevee, can do this. Come on. Didn't think so. Well, we got one last Pokeball. Or two two more Pokeballs. I'm going to save my last Pokeball just in case we see something really cool. So, after this, I'm just going to ditch it. Yep. It killed me. You freaking butt. Okay, let's go find that last yellow apricorn. We're finding red ones now, but we can't find a freaking yellow one. Okay, so... Because you need to get a yellow apricorn to make just to make a lot of different of the a lot of the really good pokeballs you need yellow apricorns to make like ultra balls and fast balls and quick balls and yeah you need a lot but we only need one so that we can just keep replanting it over and over and over and over again so that we have a bunch is that the that's the starting one that's where we started. Aw. Beginnings. But this is technically episode 6. Or, wait. 
It's either five or six. I don't know. There's a red apricorn right here next to where we spawned at the beginning. But there's still no yellow. Yellow is supposed to be one of the most common. Come on! Come on! There's a stamp over there, you freaking stamp freak. Ladybug. It'd be cool if Pixelmon could interact with the environment. Like, if something actually used explosion, then it actually exploded the ground a little bit. That would be so cool. And there's a blue one. Don't need blue, we need yellow! Bloop, 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 bloop. Oh my gosh! I feel like I've already had a yellow one. And Matt probably destroyed it without thinking about it. Matt, you little butt turd. Oh, come on! I still don't have a time for this. I'm gonna get some roses so that I can make rose red. So that I can get uh, Pokedex for me and Matt. I'm sure he'd like that. Um, okay, we gotta find the yellow. That's pink. Leafstone shard. Oh, great! I'm glitching now. Okay. <sighs> okay. Lag. How long does it take to find one yellow friggin' apricorn? You know what? With the power of editing, we're just gonna skip to where I find it. Wait, never mind. I take that back. Because I just found another Pokaloot. And it's a rare candy. Now we can go get that, uh, da 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 ba do do ba do. That Umbreon that we've always wanted. Because Umbreon is the Pokemon, is the evolution that I want most. I really want an Umbreon, okay? Don't judge me. Don't you judge me. Umbreon is my favorite, and I'm going to nickname it Darkeon. Okay, we are going to go up here. We're going to use Optifine. And we are going to find that yellow friggin' apricorn. Okay, maybe not. You need to get higher. Mm. Nope. What is that? Is that a uh, Sharpedo? The dark water type? I think it is. I think that's what it's called. Yeah, that's what it's called. Okay, so... Freaking dang it. There's a level 44 Pikachu that would kick our ass. But yeah, like I was saying before, with the power of editing, we can skip to where I find it. So see you guys in a moment. No, never mind. I'm not going to do that. This is an unedited series, so if I don't find it in the next minute, then I'm calling this episode quit. Leaf stones. Come on, man. This is probably like a 30 minute video. You can't fly Noctowls, can you? I don't think so. That'd be kind of cool, but I think they're like too tiny. And then you can fly Pidgey. Yeah, I probably shouldn't say that. Um. Well... Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, Pixelmon, or if you didn't, uh, remember to leave a like and a comment down below telling me and Matt what to do and capture next. I will have him on again, I promise, once we get everything sorted out. But thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to share this video with your friends, family, family, friends, enemies, friends, and enemies, and all the special people in your life, life, because even they have feelings too. I need a little bit of love as well. So I will see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.